Have you ever taken a trip? Do you remember the excitement that you experienced as you packed your bags? Well, I guess you say, well, it depends on whether the trip was a pleasure trip or not. For instance, if your destination was to the hospital for surgery, perhaps you experienced more anxiety than excitement. That makes perfect sense to me, but allow me to engage your thinking with this edition of Practical Assertion to offer a different perspective on that trip to the hospital. You see, while it goes without saying that one will more than likely not experience pleasure upon your arrival at your destination, the end result is what is most important. It is so typical for us to want pleasurable encounters because we are so driven by instant gratification. Some things in life, however, offer delayed gratification, and it has been my experience that these incidents will often pay dividends in the long run. For those times when you've had to reluctantly take a trip, dreading the journey the entire time, only to be pleasantly surprised at the outcome, that is the concept of delayed gratification. Upon your return, or maybe even during your trip back, you couldn't wait to tell someone about how wonderful the time spent was. You may be wondering, where am I going with all of this? So let me cut to the chase. In my role as a consultant to churches, I am constantly asking, seeking, and searching for unopened doors in an effort to assist them in their quest to grow the kingdom. That said, I have been on a journey that I call Destination Disciple. That has been a real epiphany for me. I only thought I knew what a disciple was. I only assumed I knew how to, as we've been commanded to do, make disciples. I merely scratched the surface on truly understanding the depth of commitment it requires to be called a disciple. I embarked upon this journey, and I've got to tell you, it has been a lot like the trip to the hospital. By the same token, however, I am a lot healthier because of the trip. One of the inspirations for this encounter is the fact that whenever we conduct one of our workshops and survey the participants who attend, more than 60% of them indicate that one of their issues and concerns is spiritual growth. I am happy to report that as a result of my journey, I can now help those of you who are striving for spiritual growth, and it becomes with you joining me as we journey towards Destination Disciple. If you're up for the challenge, continue viewing this video, or if you're reading, go to the link as you see here and complete the eight statement survey. Let me know what you think, email me or call me for more information, and please forward this to everyone that you know who has similar desires, and we'll look forward to seeing you again next week for another edition of Practical Assertion. By the way, if you're viewing this video, don't stop yet. Finish it to the end, and we'll look forward to seeing you next week. Take care.